Libra weekly messages for August 19th through the 26th, 2003. Welcome, Libra. I will never solicit you. I will never DM you. You come to me. I don't reach out to you. We're leaving Leo season and entering Virgo season. And this is all about details and organizing and getting on top of things and putting that thought into action. Those thoughts into action and manifesting. What do you need to know about the energy surrounding? And don't forget to check back next week for more weekly readings. So we've got the challenger. Your relationships could be challenging. It could be challenging you in painful ways. I feel like this could be somebody in your life that makes you kind of second guess yourself, that hurts your feelings, um, or causes you to feel like you are less than. Someone that maybe um, has a negative mindset, somebody that is just kind of in a darker place, this could be somebody that you've known for a really long time. It could be a family member, a friend, or it could be somebody that just entered the picture in your life. But I feel like there's a reason why this person is in your life. <clears throat> Excuse me. This is like a very challenging relationship or a challenging partnership or a connection. This is kind of toxic. This is in patterns and cycles. This could be in patterns and cycles with just people in general that are unhealthy, but to me, I'm getting this as people who are close to you, closer to you, like maybe in your family, in your social circle. Um, I feel like some people do come into our life, you know, to challenge us to heal and to heal our past and take a deeper look and, you know, look at our triggers and um, something about this situation, this energy around you. It could be that you're recreating the past. Like... If you have a partner and you're arguing, you could be recreating the past in an argument, okay? You don't have to be with, it could be a family member you're doing this with, but it's like a recreating sort of of the past or reliving the past. Um, and you're meant to ask yourself, what situations and patterns do you kind of keep recreating? Um, it's unhealed. There's something there that's unhealed. Um this person or this situation holds the key to understanding something that you need to let go of, okay? This person or this situation reminds you of a relationship from the past or someone from your past um, or, you know, a relationship with a family member um, that is broken or, you know, hurting or strained connection. I feel like you have to heal something within yourself in order for you to heal the situation with this person or this group of people or this situation. You're definitely meant to call on your, your angels, your guides, your spiritual team. Ask them to help you find the root. Find the root. This is difficult energy, Libra. I know this. This is like root work energy. This is you doing like shadow work, trying to find out the core of your triggers and how to release, release once and for all. Um, the challenger could be a person. It could be a situation that keeps coming up. But a challenger comes into your life to help you grow, to help you evolve. You don't have to be too overly concerned with this or worry about it. Whatever it is that's happening right now, this person or this situation is just trying to help you heal the past. And I do feel like you are ready. You're ready to release this, an unhealthy pattern, an unhealthy belief, an unhealthy situation, an unhealthy connection, memories, unhealthy memories from the past, a past relationship. It could be, you know, toxic person, toxic patterns, toxic behaviors. That all has to go so you can grow. In some ways, you're almost being like your own worst enemy. So let's see what else you need to know or hear. Avoid hateful thoughts as they are just as hurtful as someone physically striking. Yes, I also feel like you are working on how you think about yourself and how you think about people and situations and how people have hurt you. I feel like a lot of those words, you know, sticks and stones. No, I feel like a lot of words have hurt you. So this is also you kind of letting go of a lot of those things and replacing them with loving um, 
thoughts and loving phrases about yourself, Libra. Check back next week for more messages. Love and light.